My name is Jarko. I work at BMT since '88. We were uh, formed after Marvin Glass, one of the first toy companies in the world and in the United States. At that time at uh, UAC, we had a really old vacuum former that I really didn't like. I always had a problem with that. It was a gas heater. We have to build a frame to stretch, to staple the plastic sheet on it. And then lots of people, they, they will burn the plastic because they couldn't adjust the heat. Uh, so I heard from some friend that there's a British company that makes uh, really good vacuum formers. They get one, that's how we get uh, at Formic 450. It was one of the first models in the market at that time and we all used it a lot and we really liked it. It was a big change at school and it helped a lot with design. So when I uh, started here, uh, I wanted the same uh, vacuum former. So we got exactly the same one and it's still here, still works uh, from 80, 1988. Got lots of abuse, it still survives. It's an amazing machine because you, you can't really kill it. If you uh, maintain it properly and clean it, it will last forever. This is one of our prototypes that was done almost all, I mean external. It's all done in uh, vacuum form. And uh, of course, guts are different. Uh, inside made of different parts. Some of them are vacuum form too. And uh, this is uh, what we show to, as a prototype to Fisher Price, and this is what they need. We still use the vacuum former, and what is good with it, it's easy to use, and uh, especially to new people that we hire, it's, it takes like half an hour to explain how to use it. We as the designers, we are, of course we are building something that doesn't exist, so it's hard to imagine every detail in your head, so you, you keep changing it while you are down the road, while you are building it. And the uh, advantage of vacuum former is that it's so easy to change something like a size or something doesn't fit. You take the buck, you just drill, cut, sand, put it back in, vacuum from it's done. On a 3D printer, if something is wrong, I have to wait for like one day or whatever it takes for a piece to be printed versus vacuum former in half an hour, one hour. Another advantage is it's so easy to paint it because the surfaces are nice and flat, so save time when sanding. We use a uh, styrene and ABS, which is easy to glue and drill. As you can see here around, these are all uh, products that are on the market right now and they, most of their parts, like that truck, like even wheels and the uh, body was done on the vacuum former, Ninja was done on the vacuum former. I'm serious, we really uh, use it and we like uh, to use the vacuum former for, for now like almost 30 years.